girl it's the weekend i know you got plans so today's wig slate is going to be very convenient and it's going to get you out the door honey so if you want to see that let's jump right into it All right, so the style that I'm working with today is a deep wave texture. This is a 13 by six lace cap. Now this texture is very easy to work with. Now this wig is a beautiful wavy texture and it's already been washed. I have washed this wig and the, the waves are still very tight. And yeah, I don't have to really do much to it except put it on. I don't have to worry about frizz. I don't have to worry about defining the curls because the curls are already defined. Now, I did go back and bleach the knots when I did wash the wig, however, today's video I don't want you guys to bleach your knots because I'm going to show you this very convenient product that's going to get you out the door and yeah we'll get into that in a second so the first thing I'm going to do since I did make a mistake and have a little spillover I'm going to take some mascara and touch up the roots you can use any temporary hair dye or whatever you have if you have um, a spill out from your bleach if you do bleach the knots and it works very well all right, so the lace on this wig is a HD Skin Melt lace and it's going to melt with the skin. So the hairline on this wig is absolutely gorgeous. It's already pre-plucked. So what I'm doing for this unit is I'm going to unit. Did I say unit? You guys, I said unit. Okay, wig. What I'm going to do for this wig is I'm going to push back the hairline and kind of just lay down the um top part of the hair for my wavy wigs I definitely don't like it to be wavy all the way to the top so this is optional you don't have to do it if you don't like it but I'm gonna do it just because I feel like it gives a more clean look so let's jump into this product so perfect line Swiss have came out with their minis and girl the formula on these are amazing okay so they look like these little chapsticks and these are supposed to be more convenient for you when you are on the go so these are the new adjusted shades the tube is about a five millimeter it is water resistant and one application can stay on uh, one to two washes so just like the bigger version of this, it does come in different scalp colors. I normally use the color tan, but it goes all the way to the darkest shade, all the way down to the fairest shade. It also is smudge proof. So unlike makeup, it's not gonna smudge off. It's not gonna do any of that. You guys will see when I apply it. So if this is your first time hearing about the Perfect Line Swiss, this product is meant to give you a scalp appearance. It's going to hide those knots, hide the lace, so that your wig can look like scalp. So this is what the hairline looks like around this wig. It's absolutely gorgeous, you guys. It looks so natural. And now we are going to go right into applying the Perfect Line Swiss. So I'm gonna take this mini tube and I'm going to just put my blow dryer to it on a hot setting. It only take a few seconds for the product to loosen up. So you don't need to leave it here for a long time and you don't need to dip it in water. Don't dip it in water, you guys. Just use a dryer. Now the one thing I like about the mini tube compared to the original is that it melts a lot quicker and it's not as messy as the bigger two so if you have tried the bigger one and you didn't like it try this one this one is only ten dollars and as you can see look how easy it smooths over after just using the dryer like there's no clumpiness and i just really like this one a lot i like it a lot more than the bigger one to be honest but as you can see the scalp color tan looks like this and this actually matches my complexion very well like the color match is perfect so i'm just applying it to the part today I'm not going to apply all over the lace um, just down the parting I mean look how smooth it applied there's no lumps no clumps so I'm gonna go over it a second time I'm just taking my dryer back to it again and I want to make sure that the layer is thick enough so that I can cover those knots on the other side so just to be clear this product is not makeup at all it's not going to come off and smudge all over the place it's stuck once it's on there it can be moved around if you apply a blow dryer to the product and that's that's what I'm doing now to cover those knots. I'm making sure that this product is melted over top of the knots and I'm just making sure that everything is blended between that parting so I won't see any knots or any lace. Yes, you can wash this off and it will come off very easily with a little bit of shampoo, a small toothbrush, but the application can last you for one or two weeks if you do not want 
to have to redo it each time. Before we get any further into the video, I know you guys probably like my dress. I want you all to go subscribe to Beauty by Marie. I am revamping that channel and I want to bring new content there. So I will be putting up an outfit try on haul over there on that channel. Make sure to go subscribe. The link will be below the video and also it just popped out to you. All right, so I think the product is melted into the hair good enough. And also that mascara is touching up that area that was messed up really fine. But this is the way the scalp area looks. There is absolutely no knots visible when you put that perfect line Swiss in there. So I'm gonna go ahead and remove the lace and then we are going to apply this wig. Today's application is going to be very simple. I'm not going to use wig adhesive. If you need a wig adhesive installed, make sure to check out my previous video. I did a detailed video on my application. So yeah, definitely check that video out just popped out to you. Girl, this wig is serving scalp. This is the most hassle-free application I think I've done in a while. I'm just gonna take the Got To Be Spray and apply this wig today because I don't wanna be doing too much. You guys know it's Mother's Day weekend. I just want my hair to look slayed and laid. So like I said, if you are needing something that's going to be fast and you don't wanna do a lot to your wig, but you want that scalp appearance, you want a quick hairstyle, then this curl pattern and also the Perfect Line Swiss will give you that scalp is an easy way to achieve a quick application. I love my wavy units because you don't have to style the hair. You don't have to add layers. You don't need to do anything and it's beach friendly. Okay. So yeah, I will be sure to put this wig down below in the description box. Make sure you check that link. And I will also put the link to the perfect line Swiss down there and some discount codes for you all. So you can save some money. I absolutely love the perfect line Swiss. I, even if you have a learning curve, I feel like the minis are so easy to work with. So give it a go, you guys, try it out. Uh, I will put the link in the description box. So I wanna go ahead and do my comment appreciation because I don't think I'm gonna upload on Sunday as Mother's Day. Uh, I wanna just say happy Mother's Day to everyone out there who is a mother. I hope y'all have a wonderful, safe weekend. Enjoy yourself, pamper yourself. I will also be posting a video over on Beauty by Marie. Make sure to go subscribe to that channel. If you like my dress, the dress only cost me $7. What? Yes. So subscribe to that channel. I'm going to give you guys all the details. I'm going to jump right into the comment appreciation. And I'm just going to answer a few questions because like I said, I don't think I'm going to upload Sunday. You guys know I'm a mother, so I'm probably going to be relaxing most of the day. I did the video on the HD glue and a lot of you was asking me, well, what's the name of the glue? It's called HD glue. Someone said, <laughs> I'm sorry guys. Someone says, are we back to clear glue? Well, the thing about the clear wig adhesive, if you see my last video, I feel like the clear wig adhesives definitely hold better when it comes to people with more oily, sweaty skin. Yes, they are a bit messy. However, I do feel like they hold better than the white adhesives, if that makes sense. So Amanda says, she actually gave me a lot of questions, but the one question I wanna answer that I think a lot of you are gonna be interested in. So she asks, when you glue your wigs down, how do you keep your hair underneath dry? If you were to go swimming, if you were to shower with your wig on, if you was wearing a wig adhesive that holds. If I was to get into the pool or a beach water, swimming, whatever, you want to make sure right after you finish your day you go and you get that chlorine out of the hair you get that salt water out of the hair they do have shampoos for that you can find them um, probably at like Walgreens or CVS I like to use a blow dryer to dry the top part so for instance I would take my dryer and I would just hold it here let it dry the cap area and I will also dry the hair so I would dry the hair first and then take it here or if your wig is not glued in the back dig up and just hold the dryer under there yeah. <laughs> Angelia Brown wants to know, and I, I hope I'm saying that correctly. Do you know any product that will lay down baby hairs on my lace hair wigs like the got to be? Um, another one is the Eco Styler. Now the Eco Styler is not going to give extreme hold, but it definitely, let me show you guys, it definitely gets the job done. This is the clear one. It comes also in the yellow version, the green version, the orange, which is the argan oil. But this is just a regular clear one. Um, it moisturizes, it soothes, so 
I would try the Eco Styler Gel if you have not tried it already to lay down like if you want to wear a glueless application but you don't want your ear tab areas to lift just put a little bit of hair gel right there and I think it'll work out pretty good so yeah I hope you guys enjoyed the video I thank you so much for leaving comments give this video a like subscribe if you're new to my channel and if you are subscribed thank you so much for joining me for today's video and every other video and yeah I will see you all back in my next video again enjoy your weekend